no plans, no plans at all. Evil man's always transcending. Fight her like sheep, swallow everything. Always simple tins or pretending. We got no plans. This is your moment of clarity from LeeCamp.net. Recently, a child trafficking ring was busted in China, and 800 people were arrested, and 180 children were rescued. And it just, I'm just in awe of the evil that must exist to be involved in child trafficking. I mean, I feel like with a lot of awful things, you, you could put yourself in the person's shoes and kind of see how it happened. You know, like you read about a guy got caught off in a pink berry and you're like, oh God, that's horrific. And then you think back and you're like, but the mango is so fresh. And the, 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 the mango topping, the edge, the edges just freeze just a little bit on the pomegranate yogurt, and and you know I'm 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 not saying I would run out in a pink berry, I'm, but I've definitely been a been a in a pink berry. And finishing the job might actually be respectful rather than bumping into people with it and knocking yogurt cups off of tables. And and I'm not saying he should have done it, but if, you know if I'm on the jury, that's a that's an easy not guilty. Even if you hear of a murder, sometimes you read the details and you're like, well. She told him not to change the channel. I, I mean, and he knew she was a trained samurai. That's something he knew. He already knew that. Anybody can walk in front of traffic. We don't blame the cars. And even though I don't like Cougar Town, it was her favorite show. I mean, for sakes. So you can put yourself in the shoes of a lot of horrible deeds and possibly, possibly see how it happened. But with child trafficking, I can't do that. I don't even know how you end up there. Is it like a couple of people left babies at your house and you're like, well, I've already got a few. I might as well start selling them. Or, or are you an entrepreneur and you tried selling t-shirts and it didn't work out. So you're like, well, there's got to be more money in the baby market than this. And how do you smuggle a baby anywhere? Those things are loud and pukey and uh, annoying. I can't even sit next to one on a plane. I can't imagine having to deal with a whole bag of them or, or however they're packed. Is it a case? Is it a bag of a babies? Is it a pallet? A pallet of babies? How, a gaggle? I don't know. A yoke? A, a mess? Is it a whole mess of babies? I, I don't know the terminology. Anyway, point is, some things are so evil, I can't imagine how you justify them to yourself. Things like fracking over aquifers, lying about the damage caused by oil spills, gutting pensions, silencing scientists, showing the harm of GMOs, stealing votes, and especially smuggling a mess of babies in your pants. These things don't make any sense to me. Is the world filled with that many psychopaths or do they just convince themselves that psychopaths have a point? And what about all of the us facilitating these assholes? They say it takes a village to raise a child. Well, it takes a village to traffic one too. And it takes a village to destroy an ecosystem or steal an election. On the other hand, in an ice cream shop is generally a very solitary pursuit. That's your moment of clarity from LeeCamp.net. If you follow my uh, Twitter, at LeeCamp, you'll learn about free giveaways and tour dates and all that crap. And uh, also, I'm coming to Los Angeles this weekend. Uh, it's my West Coast CD release show, July 14th at the Fake Gallery. You can get tickets at LeeCamp.net. Thanks. Keep fighting. Plans, no plans at all. Evil man's always transcending. Fight her like sheep, swallow everything. Always simple tins or pretending.